And there we go, the fear crystal. Hey, buddy, are you feared of my crystal? You should be pretty scared right now, right? Ooh, it's the dark crystal of fear, aren't you? Aren't you terrified? Hello? Hello? This guy has uh, no emotions. Hey guys, this is Project James Fire. Welcome back to my brand new a little blacksmith shop. Look at this place. We moved into a new shop and it's looking absolutely fabulous. Now we can forge our stuff outside here in the little outside forge, I guess. So there's loads of new stuff that came to the game and I am very excited to check it out. So first of all, here's our little shop. It's absolutely amazing. Let's open the door here because oh, look at this. We've got a beautiful, magical little world and everything is new and gorgeous and I love it. Of course, we will need a name, so let's go ahead and enter. Let's see, what are we gonna call ourselves? The secret little, oh wait, hold on. The secret little uh, blacksmith. A uh, Jameis. Okay, that doesn't fit. The secret little blacksmith. Here we go. Let's see if we can make it green. A uh, nice and green. And then a little bit larger. Okay, that's a little bit too large, I think. Just a little bit smaller. There we go. Oh, that looks beautiful. The secret little blacksmith. There we go. So before we make any weapons, let's first go ahead and do a little bit of exploration. Okay, I want to see if we can get to that house. Because it looks like we've got a new neighbor. Neighbor, are you out there? Hello? I want to get some coffee with my new neighbor and get to know him, you know? Maybe he's like a really nice fella. Maybe he's also a blacksmith. Oh, maybe there's another blacksmith in town. Maybe that could be some competition for us. Wait a minute. We need to crush this guy if that's the case. Oh, wait. It says not for sale. Okay. Oh, maybe in the next update we can grab enough money and then actually buy a new forge. Oh, that would be awesome. Let's go inside. Here we go. Let's, uh, let's, oh, oh my gosh. There's an invisible wall here. Oh boy. That's not good. Maybe we can sneak around. Maybe we can sneak around into his house. Let's break into his house and steal all of his stuff. <laughs> Oh wait, hold on, we have a window here. Hello, is there anybody home? It looks uh, very empty. There's there's nothing much here, but maybe upstairs. Let's go ahead and... Oh boy, we've got another invisible wall. Okay, abort the mission. Let's go back, boys. Wait, hold on, what is that over there? Is that... Jerry? Jerry, is that you? He's walking! Holy crap! The freaking robot is moving! Are you serious? Oh, we need to get over there. Run! Run with your little... Oh, he also got a new hammer, I believe. This one looks very shiny. Oh, a new shiny hammer and a moving robot. Oh, this is gonna be great. We can actually move through the forest like this. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, guys, by the way, keep an eye out for the crystals, okay? I don't know where the crystals are, but I will be looking for them as well. If I miss any, let me know in the comments, all right? I don't see uh, any gems. I don't even see the robot anymore. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, there he is. Oh, he's moving through a tree. Holy crap. Oh, wait, hold on. What is this? Oh, boy. Oh, boy, we've got a bunch of fog here. Oh boy, I don't know. I don't like this. Hello, Mr. Robot Jerry. I mean, we named him Jerry in one of the episodes, I believe. Jerry, how are you doing? He's actually inside of a tree right now. Holy crap. Get out of the tree, boy. Talk to me. How, how are you doing? Did we activate him with the crystals last time? I'm pretty sure we did something there. How are you doing, Jerry? What if we stand in front of him? Oh no. Oh, he's gonna crush us. Oh boy. Oh. <laughs> Jerry, you are so rude. Go away. Just, just walk to eternity or something. Oh, we got something going on here. In the little flower of fields. Oh boy, I mean a field of flowers. <laughs> anyway, we've got a weapon going on here. Can we grab the weapon? Oh, it's a new weapon too. Oh, oh boy. Oh, we got the first crystal, guys. Here we go. Oh, and it says light crystal protection. Okay, so this is a crystal that is gonna give us protection or something. Oh, we have to put this in a weapon. Oh, this is gonna be fantastic. Let's see if we can push this into a sword or something. I don't know why it's so foggy though. I'm, I'm very disoriented. How do we get home? Jerry! Jerry, where's my home? Lead me home, buddy! Okay, he's not gonna guide us anywhere. He's just gonna get the hell out of here. Oh, wait, is this our forge? I think? Yes, there we go. We are back home. Out of the fog we go. There we go. So we can place this crystal. I guess we're gonna place it over here. Oh, it's got all kinds of things around it. I didn't even see that yet. Look at that. It's like a freaking galaxy around here. Oh, that is fantastic. So let's place the crystal over there. You're not gonna go anywhere, aren't you? Okay, there we go. Alright, we first have to open the shop. So let's go ahead and bang, click that shop open. Welcome, everyone. We are gonna have the most epic weapons today. It's gonna be great. Alright, so let's go outside and check out the forge here real quick. We've got some paper on the floor. Guys, I don't appreciate littering here, okay? So it says right click to pick up the parts. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, I'm gonna place this uh, right over here. There we go. So the forge has changed uh, quite a bit. Not only is it, like, outside here. We've also, let's see, what does it say here? Read first. There's a partial radio selection. Okay. Oh, now we can select if we want to make a blade or a warhammer. Oh, there's, oh, and a shield as well. Oh, maybe in the next update we can select the shields as well. But let's go for the blades this time. I want to make an epic sword, okay? Where, oh, wait, hold on. Did we get an order yet? 
Oh, there's our first customer just in time. Make a dagger, please. You've got it, buddy. And we're gonna grab this crystal and see if we can infuse this into the blade. Oh, that would be fantastic. Let's get this piece of crap right over there. There you go. Now, a dagger requires one ingot. Ingot, okay. I know how to pronounce it. It's an ingot, right? Not an ignot. That's, that's very wrong. Okay, bang. Here we go. Let's set this bad boy on fire. Now, it's, it says cooled copper ingot. I mean, ig ignot. Ingot. Ingot. <laughs> So is this gonna go from cooled to heated or something? It says, is that what we're going for? I don't know. Oh, wait, hold on. What is this? There's another crystal here. Holy crap. But this one is unknown, though. Okay, so this is the same as the last one. We're kind of like the fiery one. Alrighty, then we got another crystal. But let's see. It's a... Oh, it's a heated copper ingot. Okay. So let's place this over here. And now we can... Uh, oh, it placed itself very nicely on the anvil. There we go. Bang. Let's smash it. Actually, we need to place this crystal... Like, all the way on top of there, okay? So that it actually goes into the dagger. Come on. I want to see something go... Oh, wait. Oh, oh, and it's shiny. Holy crap. Look at this. So it's a heated copper short blade now. What happens if we... Uh, oh, oh, boy. Oh, no. No, 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 no. You're not going anywhere, buddy. Come over here. I'm going to place you right over there. Now, what happens if we hit this again? Are we going to grab... Oh, it's a different shape now. Oh, that is fantastic. Look at that. We're gonna go with this one. So this is called the forging process, okay? You you heat it up and then you hit it into like the shape that you want. Let's go with this one, okay? And then once you have done the forging, this is called quenching, I believe. You throw it in the water or in some oil and look at that. It cools the blade and then it hardens the steel. That is so cool. So now if we hit it, I don't think we can... Nope, we cannot change the shape again because the steel is now hardened. Oh, fantastic. Oh, it's actually not steel, it's copper, but whatever. Let's see if we can turn this into a proper dagger, okay? We... Oh, wow. That went really fast. But unfortunately, the little gem is not in there. Can we place this gem on there? Go in there. Go, go, go. Okay, if we do that three more times, it should work, right? Go, go, go. Nope, it doesn't... <laughs> That did not work. Okay, maybe on the next weapon. All right, here you go. That's a twin-bladed dagger for you. There you go. Don't poke anyone with it, okay? Be safe with my dagger, damn it. All right, let's see. Where's our little list where we make our money? You know, it, it, we had a list where all of the customers were at. I don't see... Oh, we got a mineral now. Uh, it's not working. <laughs> but where's that list? I thought we had like a list with our, all of our customers on there. I don't see... Oh, wait, hold on. Let's close the door. We've got a chest here with 220 bucks. Holy cow. And we sold the little dagger thingy for 19. All right, then. So let's collect our little gem here, our crystal. Let's place that next to the other one. So we've got one crystal that's unknown. We, it, it pretty much doesn't do anything, I don't think. And we've got one protection crystal. So I think if we can use this to make like a protection weapon, that would be awesome. But of course, we still have to find some of the other crystals. Now, I don't see any crystals in the water this time. Because last time, there was like one in the water. Let's just go back inside. Let's close the door here. Let's make sure that nobody steals our beautiful weapons that we don't have yet. <laughs> Let's close it. Close the door. There we go. And now we can do a little sleepy. Hell yeah. So we just jump on the bed, I think, and then click it. Yes, there we go. Day two. We feel refreshed. We should be able to smack some weapons out. All right, let's uh, open this shop again. We are open for business. But before we start today, I first want to look behind this tree. Because last time, there was a crystal here. And I want it. Where, where's my crystal, you stupid tree? All right, so the tree is innocent. Looks like we've got to move on. We can move much further than we could last time. So I'm very curious to see if we can maybe find another crystal out here in the woods. Maybe a green crystal or something. Oh, crap. Oh, we are in the middle of the fog again. That is a bad thing. So we were here before, and we found a crystal over there in the little pile here with the little secret little weapon, I guess. I don't know what this weapon is for still, but it looks very nice, though. Let's go ahead and see if we can maybe grab... Another crystal. I'm looking for a blue one and a green one. Hey, you there, Jerry! I don't know if you can see him, but he's like all the way over there in the distance. Jerry, have you seen a crystal? Come here, buddy. He really doesn't want to listen to us anymore. What a bastard. What a bastard he has become with this update. Guys, keep your eyes open, okay? Keep them peeled and wide open because I, I'm pretty sure there's got to be a crystal somewhere around here, right? Come on now. Where is it at? Oh, what is this? I see something blue. Oh, I bet you we can find a blue crystal here. Is that water? Oh, it looks like we've got some sort of a river going on. Holy crap, look at this. It's a full-sized river. Oh, fantastic. Let's go for a dive. Okay, now last time we played Formata. Actually, yesterday we jumped into the water and died immediately. Let's see if what happens if we jump here. Three, two, one, go. Let's go for a dive. Eh? Oh, oh, wait, hold on. Oh, boy. I think we're still alive, actually. We're actually swimming right now. Well, actually, we're not swimming. We're just moving. We're walking in the water. Very oh wait, hold on, what is this? Guys, I think I was right here. 
That looks like a crystal to me and it's kind of blue and purplish. Oh boy, it's a crystal unknown, let's grab it. Oh my gosh, crystal unknown everyone, there we go, we found another one, awesome. So it's a blue one from the water. I can only imagine that, oh wait, hold on, we've got another house here. A very tiny little house with no windows and no door. Ferris, oh, <laughs> hello there, we have got another crystal, hell yeah, so this is, oh wait, oh, and everything is black now. Oh, that's weird. What the hell, this is dark crystal fear. So, oh, and if you touch it, everything goes kind of black. That is weird. <laughs> so now we've got more crystals than I can actually carry. So I think uh, we should just uh, make uh, two quick runs here, I think. Right, let's open the door here. No, don't, th oh, oh crap. Oh my gosh, did the freaking thing just get thrown out of the window? Come back here, you. You're not escaping me, buddy. You're gonna be placed right here. So we've got three crystals. Let's grab the other one real quick. Oh, wait, hello. Leave a donator. One-handed hammer, please. Okay, I, I know you're in a hurry, but I'm in a hurry as well. I first need to grab that crystal over there and maybe make like a, a fair war hammer. Oh, that would be so awesome. And there we go, the fair crystal. Hey, buddy, are you fair of my crystal? You should be pretty scared right now, right? Ooh, it's the dark crystal of fear. Aren't you, aren't you terrified? Hello? Hello? This guy has uh, no emotions. So I can only imagine if we can manage to push this crystal into a weapon. If you hit someone with the weapon, I think it's gonna fear them. Somehow, right? So let's place it right over here next to the other three. So we've got fear, we've got protection, and two unknown ones. Oh boy. I think this one over here is the crystal of fire. You can probably ignite someone with that. And this is probably the crystal of, let's see, crystal of slow, I guess, because it's like icy and you can slow people with it. I have no idea. All right, what was it that you wanted? A one-handed hammer. Oh, we can make that absolutely. I think we need two of those. So let's uh, fire this bad boy up. There we go. Let's really see what happens if we, oh, uh, we are in the fire right now. Okay, so not a whole lot happens. We are just nice and comfortable here on the fire. <laughs> right, let's see if they... Yep, they are heated. Let's place them onto the anvil. I like how it kind of sticks to the anvil like... That, and it's gone. Oh, boy. What happened here? Oh, oh, what? Did that other ignite? Oh, my gosh, that was weird. He just kind of got pooped out of there. <laughs> oh, let's just hit these things. That was so... Oh, wait, hold on. I'm forgetting about something. We have to press Z and then click the blunts, okay? Because I want to have... A blunt weapon because it's it's a warhammer I guess so let's oh we got one there we go let's squish this bad boy in the water hell yeah now it's nice and cool let's see if we got a handle for it I don't know if we have another one-handed handle I don't think so we need a handle for this bad boy let's go ahead and order that right over here grips let's see we've got one-handed grip yes one of those please for two bucks let's uh, oh wow that's still very fast Let's see if we can smash this open. Come on. Uh, oh, and just disappeared. All right, here we go. A one-handed grip. We can put that onto the Warhammer thing right here, I guess. Yep, there we go. So here you go. Oh, wait, hold on. Where's the lady? Lady, where are you at? Hello? Hello? What a freaking dog. What, dog. what the worst customer ever. But we can't place it over here in the little shelves, I guess. And then once she is here, she can pick it up, I think. I don't know, man. <laughs> Anyway, guys, as you can see, the sun is setting. It is turning night again, so we are gonna go sleepy, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Please do a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next Project Days Live video.